Keith Lee just announced the next stop in his food tour, and it's going to be the DMV area. Y'all check this out. I've been waiting to talk about this for a minute, but I kept being told that I couldn't. I don't care no more. We about to talk about it. Let's talk about it. I already know it's hard to see on my face, but my level of excitement through the roof. If the roof here, I'm up here. Very soon, we're going to be in the DMV. So that means D.C., Maryland, Virginia, and all surrounding cities. Here we come. I can't wait. If you or anybody you know has a mom and pop shop or a family-owned spot that has great food and great customer service but could use the marketing for absolutely free to them, let me know. And very soon, it's going to be a poll on my IG story for the most popular restaurants that embody the food scene in your opinion. You can tag me in their videos. You can tag them in this video. You can DM me on IG. Have you want to get in contact with me, email, as well as restaurants from different backgrounds, different cultures, or different ethnicities. Please DM me. Or again, however you want to get in contact with me. And very soon, it's going to be a poll on my IG story for the most popular restaurants that embody the food scene in your opinion. And when I say your opinion, I mean the locals of the DMV, so y'all can vote on them. I'm checking all my mentions, all my emails, all my tags. I'll see y'all soon. God bless you. Have an amazing day. Y'all be safe. D.C., Maryland, Virginia, here we come. God is amazing. If you don't know what the DMV area is, it's D.C., Maryland and Virginia and they have a distinctively different accent y'all it's pretty cool to me I don't know if it's just Maryland the people from Maryland that talk like that or if it's all the whole area but it's pretty cool but this is very interesting because sometimes you don't hear about the food culture in these different places not unless you really live close to there or you live there. But if you live in other places, you don't really hear about certain food cultures in different areas. It's going to be very interesting to see what restaurants that Keith Lee goes to and more about the food culture and the food that is in the DMV area. If you're from the DMV area, comment below what's popular in your area like what kind of foods do y'all like? What kind of foods do y'all normally cook? But if you have a restaurant in the DMV area, anywhere around there, you better go ahead. This is the time right now. You better go ahead, get that marketing in place, and go ahead and get yourself out there because he might visit your restaurant. And you just never know what could be in store for you, man. You just never know. If you need that exposure, you better just go ahead and get your ducks in a row and be ready. Just be ready. It's going to be good and exciting to see all of the different foods that are in D.C., Maryland, and Virginia. I don't even know. Like I, I don't know about the culture, but that's why I'm tuning in because I want to learn more about the culture. Y'all can't deny God has really blessed Keith Lee to put him in this position to be able to bring more exposure to the restaurants that need exposure, y'all. Like, every time, it's just a blessing. Like, the way I look at it, it's just a blessing for him to be able to bring that kind of exposure to these small businesses that need it. Y'all can't deny that. It. It's the power of God right there. Y'all cannot deny that that is truly the power of God. <laughs> and that's all I'm going to say right now. But that's all for this video. Make sure you like and follow for more. I will see you in the next video. Peace.